Now, if you just install Kodi 17 Krypton and then it gives you this look, then you're kind of like, what the hell is this? So, this is the official look of Kodi 17. They're kind of trying to reinvent Kodi. But, if you actually like the defaulted skin that you're used to is Confluence or any other skin, then this is the only way to change it. Now, before you go ahead and go to the settings and try to find skin settings and if, see if you could actually change it there, you cannot. You have to actually install... Um, a, a different skin and the way to only do that is going by the add-ons enter add-on browser and go to the install from repository and this will give you this so right here where it says look and feel and then go ahead and skin and you can actually get the skin again uh, by choosing confluence now I don't think a lot of these are enabled for um, Krypton but I know for a fact that Confluence should be working. So let's go ahead and install this. Install that. Give it a few seconds. And would I like to switch? Of course. So there it is. You are officially back to Cody 17 the way it's supposed to look. Now, if you don't believe me, and there it is Cody 17.0 come compiled at February 1st 2017 I'm actually using a Mac right now so you could actually change back if you want to go to settings and interface go to skin and uh, let's check what this app it won't let me so let's go to that again and then go to skin we could actually go to the interface settings. You could actually change it there from there and all. So that's the way to actually get back Confluence if you want it back. And from then on, you could actually get more if you want to install any other ones as well. So there's many ways to actually installing the other um, skins that you normally like and see. So that's basically it. I hope you liked this video and hopefully it helped you out. And thanks again for watching. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to our channel and like our videos. And follow us on Twitter at XBM Connect to keep up with the updates.